Welcome to Moon Light Shadows. This is a collective reading for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus in the North Node. Aries, you guys have the devil. Everything is fine in the Nine of Wands. You guys could be feeling attacked or you could feel like tired from... I'm getting Aries. You guys are fighting demons in your sleep because it's like you're asleep and there's like the devil. But they're like trying to throw the daggers at you. But then it's like, I'm cool. I'm on my phone. I'm fine. So it's like you could be having some significant nightmares. They're really stressing you out. You could astral project um, and you feel really tired when you wake up because this is you like in the wounded warrior. And it's like you're tired, like you got battle scars, but you're still standing, you know, like you're perfectly fine. You're looking at this devil, like, like F you devil, you know, like there's something here, like you're really upset that you're being, your sleep is being disturbed is what I'm getting. Um, you guys are spiritual warriors, Aries, because there's wands and fires like so present here. Lots of root chakra energy. Um, continue to listen to music and meditation because that will help heal and remove and cleanse this negative energy. I did also sage before. Um, yeah, with the sword. It's like, wow, you guys are really being spiritually attacked. Spiritual warfare is what I'm getting. With the ten of swords, you're very gifted, Aries. You have a lot of fire. You have a lot of passion. And with both of these cards, it's like you're fine. Even though this devil energy is trying to attack you, they can't. I'm getting, they can't hurt none of us. Ten of swords. So the Aries, positive energies. You guys are spiritual warriors. You're being attacked because it's a spiritual warfare. But you are fine. Like, you're ending this devil energy. You're able to fight these people off because the universe is giving you the spiritual abundance, the wisdom, the inner guidance on how to battle this, these monsters is what I'm getting. And with the knight, nine of wands and the knight of swords, you're tired of it, but you're still taking action like you have your sword. You're definitely a spiritual warrior. This is Chiron, the wounded warrior. Right here. This is literally you. Like you're tired, but you're like, I'm going to do it. I have the strength to pursue and to to take down these demons is what I'm getting. Literally, you guys are really spiritual and very strong. Um, if you're not gifted, whatever, if you feel like you're not spiritual, you're not fighting anything in your sleep, this just means that life is throwing a lot of painful situations or challenging situations and you're tired of it, but you are still moving forward with the Knight of Swords. You are pursuing and overcoming all of these challenges successfully, but this is very specific for someone who is spiritual. It is part of your past life. Remember who you are. Connect to your Kashuk records. There are significant messages. You're tapping into one chapter of your life, but there's so there's something else very significant. It's part of your shadow work that you haven't really un. I'm hearing you haven't opened it. You haven't discovered it. It's unclosed. Uh, what's it called? Unclosed information disclosed. Like that's not coming through right. It's confidential information only available to you. No one else can give it to you except the divine. Like here's the hand. You're starting to tap into it, but now you're fully going to get the full picture. There's one thing. There's another file you need to reach out to in your Akashic Records. It will be given to you with the Ace of Pentacles. You will discover what that is. Um, you also have left. You have two. Di I told you there's one thing you've discovered, but then there's something else that you haven't. So it's like this is one thing about your money, and this is the hidden thing about your past love life. You're connecting to your Akashic Records. You need to meditate more. Um, yeah, the messages will be delivered to you very swiftly within eight days and there's stability and love coming from uh, another. Okay. So I'm hearing another earth sign. So maybe you're dealing with two earth signs, but this is love coming towards you, Aries, um, <clears throat> Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy, or this is just someone from your past life that you're connecting to. That's going to give you an offer of love because pentacles are stability and financial success. So I feel like you are going to have everything happiness and love. I think Libra also got the Ace of Cups. So maybe you're dealing with a Libra with a Virgo placement is what I'm hearing. But you have Libra um, or you have, excuse me, Libra had the same cards. So I don't know why I said you have Libra. So maybe you are pursuing a Libra or you have a Libra placement in your needle chart, but watch the Libra reading because there are significant messages there for you as well. 404 stability is going to come your way. Everything is fine. Keep fighting, keep practicing, praying, cleansing, saging. You're a strong spiritual warrior and that's why you have low vibrational energies trying to attack you. There's no person attacking you. It's spiritual. That's what I'm hearing. So keep connecting to your angels, your ancestors, and guides and you will be successful. You will come out victorious. Those are the messages for you, Aries. Let me know if that resonates. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Tap the notifications bell so you get all of my updated videos. I'm sending you guys lots of love and light. Bye, guys.